Looks like we might be getting some new cross-core customization options coming with Season 3 and when the pit will be playable for us. So if you want to know everything, stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details. The leaky boy that we like to source quite often on the channel here, Sarasia, who is quite credible with this leak, says that cross-core equipment partial support is most likely before Season 3. Not everything will fit, but a lot will. Continue on saying equipment as in torso, hip, helmet, wrist attachments. Coatings are the hardest thing to get cross-core working because everything has different regions stuff goes to. And just slapping a Mark 7 coating to a rich Spartan can cause the entire body to glow as the zones don't match. So if you remember when Jerry Hook went on to the live stream talking about bringing Crosscore into Halo Infinite and saying that it will be a rather painstaking process, it's because of that. Since each coating and each item was originally supposed to be designed specifically for that set, to create it across the other sets requires a completely new coating, essentially within the game. Though obviously Crosscore is much needed for the game. I think things like coatings and attachments for your armor were very much something that can be Crosscore, I think not relatively easily, but very possible. But Jerry Hook warned us saying that it could be a piece by piece item of making it cross core and that sounds like that's what they're doing. That's why it's taking so long as making these items cross core available is having to go down to an individual item basis to make sure that it all functions properly. While cross core is awesome, I still just kind of have a feeling that what if they just kind of focus on making new content rather than trying to make the content that they have cross core available because it's definitely a pain for customization at the start of a game because there's only so much we have available but after you get a few seasons under your belt you feel like you have kind of generally enough customization to kind of create the spartan that you want i feel like i'm just barely starting to get there right now but certainly at the beginning of the game yeah it was pretty bad as this is a developing story i'll let you guys know as soon as we get some more details about cross core customization coming into halo infinite next we have a vague time frame of when to expect the pit to come into halo infinite right here uh, recently on the r slash competitive halo page here they basically just said when do we expect to see this coming out maybe season two or something like that and the head of hcs tashi says the plan is for the pit remake to go into the rotation for year two of hcs now we don't have a roadmap quite yet when year two will start or anything like that but we do know that hcs and tashi do agree that they want to have a more truncated season not so dragged out as it was previously so i could see the start of the season probably in maybe February, March kind of time frame. As we do have the World Finals happening at the end of October here in Seattle, which I will be there. If you guys see me there, make sure to stop by and say, hey, we'll grab a pick or something. But all throughout the months of November, December, and most likely January, when 3 for 3 kind of filters back into the office after their end of the year vacation time, I could see things kind of starting to ramp back up when it comes to maybe announcements probably towards the end of January, and maybe things ramping up probably more towards February, and maybe seeing the first event of Season 2 happening maybe like in March or something like that at the earliest. Though we did have the Forge lead to Michael Score say that it will come out soon after the launch of Forge for Halo Infinite. But I do expect to see the map come into rotation probably around December or something like that. As this pit remake has been in the works for months now at this point, if you guys didn't know, they've been working on this behind the scene along with some rumored other maps like Narrows and Guardian likely to come into the game as Forge creations after the Forge update. But of course, those are all rumors and speculation. And once we get some concrete details, I'll share it with you guys here on the channel as I always do. If you guys want to know some more detailed information about the pit remake the fan reaction which was not very good and tatanka possibly being delayed till 2024 check out this video right here thank you very much for watching catch you on the next one peace out